Hey guys, it's Sienna. We're here on another video and today we're doing something super exciting. But I'm super nervous. So back home at my home campus, I'm in a dance club and I'm not by any means a good dancer at all. Like I, I only have college experience in it, but it's something I really love. Since I've gotten to college, I have taken a few dance classes for theater and ballet and things like that. So I have a little bit of experience, but one of the biggest things I've always wanted to do is go to an actual dance studio and take a class. And today I get to do that. Um, there's this studio that I know is here in LA that I've had in the back of my mind that I'd want to go see and take a class from, but I'm always nervous. I'm like, well, what if they don't really accept beginners? And it's just like anxiety. But last night I found out that this studio is actually quite a bit closer to me than I thought it was. So I did some more digging, found that there is a beginner's hip hop class tonight at five. So I'm going to be taking the half hour uber over there i don't know if you've guys heard of it it's millennium dance studio they have quite a bit of videos online they dance to all types of different songs all different music and the choreography is really good they have some really famous choreographers there that do a lot of stuff with other singers and like movies and theater and things like that and i've heard I, I don't know, I, I'll see it when I'm there, but um, they have pictures up on the wall of all of the celebrities that they've worked with and like little notes from the celebrities themselves. So I will be sure to record that and I will let you know how it went. <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm back <laughs> from the dance thing. I'm back on campus. Um, still, I'm still quite warm from that. So I'm sitting outside, but there's a breeze. <sighs> but it was so much fun. Like, I don't know why I was nervous. Like, obviously I was nervous because it was a new experience and there's people there that know how to dance like professionally. So I was kind of intimidated by that but it was a beginner class so it was pretty simple like the moves like were still kind of complex but the meaning of the beginner class there is just that it's slower they go over the moves a bit more and um, i was potentially going to stay for a regular hip-hop dance class but uh, with how tired i was after the first one and the fact that I was just barely keeping up with the beginner one, I decided doing a regular one at this time was not a good idea. But ultimately, I will go back. I had a lot of fun. Um, it's a good way for me to encourage my dancing while I'm here since I don't have my dance club here. And it's also just a way for me to get better at it considering it is something that I love and something that I'd like to continue after college. So it's just a great opportunity, I think. And that's the thing about this, is the whole thing of me being in California, it's getting out of my comfort zone. So why not just go to this dance studio that I wanna go to anyways and get out of my comfort zone a little more. So when I got there, obviously I was still super nervous. I'm like, okay, my Uber driver got lost on the way there. So I literally showed up at five o'clock when the class was starting. So I like run inside and <laughs> I'm like, hey, I'm here for this class. And they're like, okay, they check my name off the list. And they said, go right in there. It was like the first door. So <laughs> super easy. I just got right into stretching with them. And then it was an hour of straight movement. It is the best cardio workout I've ever gotten, I think. Like an hour of continuous movement dancing it was so much fun but i was so tired i didn't have time to get water i had brought pre-workout to take before that but like i didn't i don't know why i didn't take that in the 
car on the in the Uber, I would have given me a bit more energy, but I was so tired at the end of it, but so happy because it was so much fun. Uh, hey, sorry, camera died, so I had to move inside, um, get that charged, and now we're back. So yeah, after the dance class, I sat outside for a little bit to cool off, just breathe a little bit, drink some water, and then I went back inside to just explore a little bit and like i said before the our walls are just covered up and down with pictures of the celebrities they've worked with so it has their autograph on the picture and like a little note saying thank you and you're always there and that was super cool to see just how many pictures were up there i couldn't get them all in the video but it was up and down the walls and then on the other wall facing that they had pictures of all the choreographers that they work with. So that was cool because I got to see pictures of choreographers that I kind of follow through YouTube videos and their YouTube channel and things like that. It always says who's choreographed the video. So it was cool to kind of put faces, like even though they're in the video, like see an actual picture and their name. But after that, because I wasn't staying for the other dance class, I did get my lift back and we're back here on campus and I am so excited for next Wednesday, a week from today, so then I can go again. Hopefully I will be able to go to the dance again if nothing comes up on Wednesday. But um, next time I will be taking the bus down though because a half an hour Uber down there got kind of expensive to go there and back. So I will be taking the bus next time for sure. But I am super excited to go back. I already met like a friend. Yeah, overall it was a great experience. Go ahead and if you're on an exchange or even <laughs> at your home campus, like don't be afraid to get out of your comfort zone because it may be scary at first, but the payoff can be so much better than if you were to not do it. You can make new friends, you can have new experiences, find something that you didn't know you were good at, find new passions. Like there's so much to do. If there's something that you don't even know if you're good at, you're just slightly interested in it, like join the volleyball club or start weightlifting or it doesn't even have to be exercise go to a gaming club or i know at my home campus there's a gaming club that is strictly for board games they don't play video games they just get together and play board games so that might be uncomfortable for you because you don't know anyone there but getting out of your comfort zone and going to these things can help put yourself out there. You can make lifelong friends, have great experiences, make great memories. I know going to the studio is something I'll remember for the rest of my life because it's something I've been wanting to do. I've been looking up to the studio for years, watching their videos. And to say that I was actually at the studio is amazing to me and that I can go back and I'll continue to go back as much as I can throughout my time here in LA and I'm so glad I went early because when I first wanted to go to this dance thing, I was like trying to talk myself out of it because I was so nervous. But I knew that if I liked it and I waited, like if I waited till later, like a month or so, and I liked it, I would have regretted not coming this week. I would have regretted not going sooner and getting more opportunities to go because I'm only here for a semester. And if I go halfway through the semester, well then I've wasted like a month or so that I could have been continuing to go and getting better at dancing and meeting new people and having fun. So I'm glad I went when I did. I really try to live without regrets. So I'm really glad I went and I'm super excited to go again and meet new people and learn new dance moves. I'm so excited. So that was my week this week here at CSUN and I will see you guys next week.